Hi, my name is Dr. Zach Shaw, and I'm with the Upper Cervical Spine Center here in Charlotte, North Carolina. And did you know that the most common way to treat neck and back pain is by popping an Advil or an ibuprofen? Ibuprofen is a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug, or an NSAID, okay? And actually, chronic use of NSAIDs can cause a lot of problems. Research shows that it increases your risk of fatal peptic ulcers by fivefold. It also can cause acute renal failure, so kidney problems. It can cause problems with your heart. It can even cause heart attack, stroke, heart failure even. Research shows that cognitive impairment occurs with chronic uh, NSAID use. And also, these NSAIDs can counteract high blood pressure medications. And so, if you're taking a blood pressure medication to keep your blood pressure lower, and then you're taking an Advil because you have neck pain, it's actually counteracting that drug, causing an array of issues throughout your body. And so, we want to try to avoid this use of Advil when we have neck and back pain. And actually, when it comes to taking an Advil for your neck and back pain, all it's doing is masking the symptoms. It's never getting to the cause of that neck and back pain. Think about it. You take an Advil, the neck pain goes away. Is it because you had a deficiency in Advil? Of course not. You've never had a deficiency of a drug, so a drug like Advil is never going to fix the problem all it does is mask the symptoms. And so we've got to get to the cause of your neck and back pain. And that is why I do what I do as an upper cervical chiropractor. I get to the cause of your neck and back pain by locating, analyzing, and correcting interference to the nervous system. So how does this interference or how does a misalignment in the upper cervical spine cause neck and back pain? Well, your brain has its own reflex called the riding reflex, and it forces the brain to always be level. But a misalignment at the top of the neck and the upper cervical spine that could have been all the way back at birth, maybe a slip and fall as a kid or as an adult, maybe a car accident or a sports injury in your past, throws this bone out of alignment that takes the head with it, and now your brain is not level. So that writing reflex kicks in and it forces a chain reaction down the entire spine in order to compensate this misalignment, it causes the spine to twist and turn and bend and rotate in order to balance the head, okay? This allows the brain to balance, but these compensations over time form weak spots in the spine. And these weak spots are what turn into pain, especially pain in the neck and the back. So that is where your neck and back pain come from. And so popping Advil or popping an ibuprofen or whatever is only going to mask the symptoms. We've got to get to the cause of your neck and back pain. So it's a great, great idea to visit an upper cervical chiropractor. If you are in the Charlotte, North Carolina area, give our office a call at 704-588-5560. We will be happy to do a consultation free of charge to see if maybe your neck and back pain is related to upper cervical issue. If you're not in the Charlotte, North Carolina area, please give our office a call anyway, and I promise we will find an upper cervical doctor as close to you as possible. I hope you learned something today. I hope you get that atlas or that upper cervical spine checked out, and you have an amazing day. All you need to know is that conventional medical care really just treats the effects of your condition. Drugs and surgery really just mask the symptoms. And although surgery can be warranted sometimes, very rarely is it needed. With upper cervical care, we find the cause of your condition by finding the misalignment in the top of the neck, putting pressure on your brainstem, which interferes with the messages between your brain and your body. Give our office a call today.